morning you guys it's 7 30 today we have a play date and i think that's pretty much all we have planned today um but the boys are downstairs playing i'm gonna make the beds real quick and yeah i still have to do my hair just straighten it because i've not been putting conditioner in my hair i've just been putting shampoo in my hair and it feels like it feels less greasy. I don't know if it's the conditioner I was using. And I, when I put conditioner in, I only put it like up to here. I don't put it like on my scalp. Um, but for some reason, even with it just being down here, it felt like it was gross after a day. And my hair usually never feels like that. So I don't know what's going on. But anyways, I'm gonna make the beds and then do my hair and then get the boys dressed. plans we are not going on a play date because there was a two hour delay for my friend's kids school and Paxton's school even though it doesn't affect Pax even though it doesn't affect Paxton because he goes in the afternoon it does affect their kids we're gonna have a play date on Thursday because tomorrow I cannot have a play date because I have my orientation and registration and I'm so nervous you guys like things like this literally give me anxiety and i'm so thankful that my cousin is coming with me because you can bring up to three guests which i thought was like pretty surprising but you can so she's gonna come with me i'm praying it was it starts at like eight so i have to drop off the boys and pick her up and then drive 35 minutes to drop off the boys at rob's parents house and then drive 20 minutes to the school but it's supposed to run till two o'clock but i'm praying that we get out like 12 12 30 that would be amazing because i do not want to be there for that long and i really would feel bad if she was with me for that long but she doesn't mind and thank god she doesn't and she's amazing so thank you so much katie i am starving i just put maverick to bed it took me forever to get him to sleep i don't know he just kept saying skateboard skateboard because he couldn't find the skateboard um before he went to sleep so i feel bad but i mean not that he sleeps with it but he just likes me to rock him with the skateboard you guys this kid is obsessed with the skateboard it's like so funny i'm like maverick i can't find the skateboard we looked all over it we cannot find it so finally finally he fell asleep it took me like 35 minutes to get him to sleep because he was worried about his skateboard the boys are just eating their healthy healthy lunch we're watching Cassidy's vlog and it's so funny. He's like, are you talking? Oh, it's just a video. Because <laughs> he's used to me like talking to her on FaceTime. So he's like, doesn't know at first. Like, is this just a video or are you talking? So funny. I really have to clean downstairs. I have to like sweep and clean under that couch, you guys. Because we don't have blinds, it gets so dusty downstairs, which is so frustrating because like I vacuumed yesterday and you would not be able to tell because everything like you can just see the dust accumulates like so fast on here like i don't know you guys can't really tell too much but it looks so dusty to me like especially like where the sun is it just looks like see the dust right here like it just is so dusty and i just cleaned under the couch like a week and a half ago and that's like a big job because you have to take every section of the couch apart um so now i need there's a cat in my driveway um so now i need to do this again and it's like so annoying I really want to get the foam piping that goes over pipes and put it under my couch. That way nothing can go under my couch. That will be amazing. I'm definitely going to budget for that next month because that will help nothing get under there. Because the day you, the day I take the cars out of there, there's more cars under there. There's not a ton, but there's still definitely things under there. And I need to clean my TV because Maverick for the past three days will not stop climbing up here and touching the TV, touching it like crazy. It's disgusting. And every time I take him down and I say no, he comes right back up. Probably, I'm not even kidding you, probably like 15 times yesterday, up and down, up and down. <sighs> well, you guys, I don't know if this can get any worse. We'll have to just wait and see. Um, all of a sudden, I'm walking into the laundry room to change the laundry and my foot gets wet. I'm like, what in the world did I happen? The uh, washer leaked all over. I don't know why. Yeah, this towel um, soaked everything. 
is wet in here. Thank God this isn't like laminate flooring. It's just tile. We're just going to close it and pretend it never happened until Rob gets home. I don't want to text Rob and tell him because I don't want to stress Rob out at work. Um, and I'd rather just wait and tell him until he gets home. And then, let me push this fire in. The plus side fire is going. But then I was vacuuming the couch and I was almost done. I think I had like one more cushion to do. Thankfully it's there's nothing under there because no one sits in that section. Um but I vacuumed the couch, cleaned under the couch and everything and um my vacuum died. Uh yeah so I think my vacuum died because my fault. I was sucking, you know, some stuff up and I sucked up some cereal and they like, the way they went in, they like all bunched together and I think it like blocked the air and it like, I don't know if it burned the motor out or what's happening, but now it will not turn on. So I'm trying to let it cool down and hoping that I can get it to work. If I has to come home and I have to tell him that two things are broken. Oh God, I just don't. Please turn on, please turn on. No, it's not turning on. Eh, eh, eh. Oh my God, I think the motor burned out. Why? What am I gonna do? The washer and the vacuum. Two things that are important to have when you're trying to keep your house clean. So those things are gonna drive me insane. And I'm praying that they can be fixed. Cause I have a tiny dirt devil vacuum that's horrible. Um, it just it goes up off by like air, like suction. And, like the thing doesn't actually spin, if that makes sense. On a brighter note, I did find Maverick's skateboard. So that's gonna be adorable when I give that to him. Found it under the couch. I just can't reach it. Can you guys see it right there? It's there. All right, I got it. Now let's go see Maverick's adorable reaction. Maverick, surprise! <gasps> Go find it. What is that? Go find it. Skateboard. Go find it. Go find it. <laughs> it was under the couch. <laughs> Are you happy? Skateboard. Give me a kiss. <laughs> I know that is your skateboard. So cute. I love how obsessed he is with his little skateboard. Oh my gosh, it's bright in front of that window. 12, 20 almost, we have to get the boys, well not really Maverick, he's just, just putting a jacket on him. Um, but I need to get Paxton dressed, I have his clothes out, I need to get him dressed, get myself dressed, and then go off to drop him off at school. And then I need to come home and figure out what I'm gonna do with these two problems, try to fix them. I don't know what I should do about the washer. I'll have to like look that up. I don't know, it like wasn't making any weird noises. I don't know why it would leak and it leaked a ton. So yeah. Book bag. Come on. We gotta do your hair. We gotta brush your teeth. We gotta get dressed. We gotta get everything going. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, all right, without pushing, please. I know, dude. What are you doing? Why are you so cute? Why are you so cute? Ready for school? Yeah. Yeah. The boys are in the cutest outfits. We got little navy blue joggers on and then this like um, plaid shirt, collared shirt. It's so cute. Hi guys. Hi. This Maggie. It's <laughs> wrong way. I'm going to get and this mommy. Hi guys. And this Maggie. We're leaving 10 minutes early and that's because Paxton's school got delayed two hours, well not two hours actually. His school, well I guess, yeah, his school did get delayed two hours and then the AM preschool class is coming in the PM so it's gonna be packed and the parking lot's um, plowed but where the trucks usually park, they didn't plow, like all the snow that was in the parking lot got pushed up to those spots so yeah. I don't wanna be stuck like with no spot. We're having trouble to find a parking spot with this thing. So we're gonna leave a little bit early. Go go bye bye. Say bye bye. Bye bye. Say shoo. Boo. 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 Put your jacket on. 
Brooke, oh. I know it broke, sweetie. <laughs> Say hi. Say hi. No. Broke. He's telling you guys it broke. <laughs> All right, we still do our like egg surprise at the end of the day. Well, after Pax is, Paxton is done school, if he was good and followed like his schedule and everything and had a good day at school, he gets to have some like a special treat. So he is picking a sour candy. So he has like a, a sour patch kid that we've had for like, um, I don't even know, two months now. Um, so he's allowed to get one of those. They look so, so adorable today on their match with their matching outfits. I've been trying to get a hold of Maverick's doctors because he has an appointment tomorrow, just like a regular checkup. Um, like a wellness visit and of course it's tomorrow like any other day would be fine but tomorrow i have my orientation so i cannot take him we are all very tired we just had dinner we just had leftovers from last night it is five 50 and I'm giving the boys a shower early because I, it's just how tired I am and then I'll probably bring them back downstairs for a little bit but Rob is still not home he's at his uncle's fixing his computer I have such a headache you guys right now it's 7 48 I'm getting ready to end the vlog and then edit and tomorrow I have such bad anxiety because I have my orientation and registration for school but I fixed the vacuum, so that is a plus. I actually forgot to tell Rob about the washer when he got home. He didn't get home until 7 o'clock, um, but I forgot to tell him about it, so I cleaned it all up. I'm not going to use it until he looks at it, but yeah, I forgot to tell him. Whoops. Um, hopefully that's okay. But um, anyways, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching today's vlog. I hope you guys liked it, and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye, guys.